everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Today we're going to do an Audi haul, so let's see what I've got in Audi. I've got quite a lot actually, to be honest. I know that this is quite a lot of stuff, to be honest, and I did pick up a few extras. You know, when you pick up a few extras that you wasn't actually on your list. But see, Audi do this thing where they sort of entice you with their deals and their little goodies. So, yeah, let's just have a look and see what I've got. So, that's everything I got. And I believe I spent £85. It's not usually what I would spend. And it's, this will probably last us for like two weeks. 100% this will last us around two weeks. Um, just getting the essentials during the week. So let's start over here. There's a lot of stuff. I don't actually have enough side, if you notice. So yeah, um, I did also get like washing stuff and things like that as well. So it isn't all food. Um, maybe that's why it's eighty-five pounds. You know what it's like. Uh, but yeah, here we go. So I'm going to show you this first. This here is just standard for pet lunch. So it's just sandwich fins. I like my daughter likes them most actually, uh, but they're just nice and light rather than pop bread. You know, just different. These are croissants. So just chocolate croissants. My kids love them. Then we've got bananas. Always need bananas. We've got strawberries. My son's already sneaked a peek in that. Um, oh, it's really difficult to go around. There's quite a lot here. Apples, standard. Then we've got, so this is like, this mainly apples in this house gets eaten by my daughter. She likes them in her pet lunch. She just loves, in fact, she has about, well, she loves apples, put it that way. Then we've got beans. Now this I, I think is amazing because these are actually for a pack of four and they taste just like Heinz or if not better, to be honest. They are only like 99p or something for pack four, and I think that's amazing because you always need beans. I mean, you know, quick snacks, beans on toast, or beans in. Have you ever tried the sandwich fin pockets of these? They don't do them in Aldi, I don't think, but when I have them, I do cheese and beans with them in the toaster, and they're so nice. Um, so yeah, beans are a must, and obviously, jack potato with beans on it. Always need beans. Then we've got some cookies. We love biscuits in this house, we are the biscuit house chocolate i mean it's obviously what you think that looks like yeah we all know what that looks like that looks like twix then here same here mars so like that fake marses oh no that's fake marses sorry that's fake snickers that's it gather my fault uh these biscuits i absolutely love these we love biscuits that's anyway but you know like the oat biscuits what they're called hobnobs I think, a bit like that with the chocolate on, really nice. Yep, ice rings, standard. My son loves them, everyone loves biscuits in his house. I'm just gonna try and see if I can get through with this. Oh my God, it's all stacked. These little mini, like, um, what are they called? <sighs> now I'm losing my train of thought, but we, I think you know what they kind of are like. If I remember, I'll let you know. Uh, but yeah, you get like 16 of these and they're really, really good just for, uh, pat lunches, obviously just general, but for pat lunches they're really good. Like you know, my son and my daughter for nursery and school. Then we've got these. These are like a healthy. These are really good as well. I can't remember the price of these now, but they're really good price. I just remember that. And these are fat free. Oh. Fat free, ninety nine calories per pot. So my other half would have these. He's always is a gym freak, and he but he likes a treat. He does like a treat, so these are a nice treat for him. They're just basically lo loads of yogurts in there, so there's six of them in there. But yeah, they're just really good. Um, or you can put extra fruit in them, you know, make them a little bit more delish and a little bit more healthy. Uh, so these here are actually not ours. So my mum absolutely loves these, and they're only like 49p. Yeah, 49p, and in Sainsbury's, the, these sort of versions of these they're smaller for one and they're a lot more money I think each so every time I go in, in Audi my mum doesn't allow me 
to tell uh, to go in there without picking of these. If I, if I don't pick these up for her because they're like gold dust in there, if I don't pick them up for her, then she gets the hunt with me. So that's why we've got the toffee desserts there. So this here is mint, and we're going to have spaghetti bolognese with that this week. We always have spaghetti bolognese during the week at some point. It's a family favourite. We like the five percent beef mints and this is quite a good pricing as well um for how much you get this here i've never actually picked this up before and i thought i don't know if it's new i'm not sure but i thought this was amazing let me just get this straight right so i am very busy all the time i have my business that i run i have two children and i have my house to keep on top of it's all very hard work uh, so I don't have loads of time all the time to sort of make it all nice and prepped and stuff. So these are just, this is really quick, like, well, say quick. It's just all, it's all set out for you rather than you having to chop these things up, chop that up. I mean, I'm sorry for the people who are watching that like to do all of that. I don't really like that. I just like convenience as the most convenience as possible, but with still being healthy. So this here is, it serves four people. So perfect for our family. Chicken, it's just a meal kit, chicken casserole. Just explains itself, really. But we'll have this this week, and I thought that was really good. And again, that was about £3 something, so I thought that was really good value um, for what that is. Here, we love the beef lasagna. Again, I'm convenient. But this here is really quick and easy, and I can't remember how much this one is, but it's really cheap as well. But it's actually the best ready-made, whatever, beef lasagna you'll get. It's really nice, and it feeds us all, and it's fine. It's nice. My kids absolutely love, they absolutely love uh, hot dogs. So we've got hot dogs, um, chips, fries. These are about eight, I think they're like 89p or 79p or something for these chips. Not being funny, but they're just French fry things. And you know, you can get some of the makes that are really expensive. And I just think, wow, no, rather save my money. So next up, we've, we're going to have this because I did do, I did do a bit of, a meal plan for this week so at least I managed to get all of our dinners because I don't know about you but for me I find it really difficult to make sure when I go food shopping to make sure I have enough meals so that's going to sound really strange to some people a lot of people might actually relate so let me know in the comments if this is you do you ever go food shopping spend a ton of money and come out with hardly any meals like dinner meals please put in the comments below now if this is you because I've actually a few of my friends are like this and I'm like it so I can't be the, I'm obviously not the only one but uh yeah it's really annoying so this time I made sure that what I done was in because you know for meal planning for the week I made sure I had a meal for every single day at least right so I did that plus obviously snacks and all that but it's really easy for me to pick up snacks so to be honest with you that isn't my issue um, it's normally dinner so yeah so I'm going to turn it back around now but I just thought it's nice for you to see my face you know when I'm actually talking to you so yep pie one of our meals for this week this here I love roast what is it roast in a bag chicken whole chicken in a bag again all herbed up you know all seasoned if you like if that's what it's called uh, that will just go in that will be our Sunday roast this here so we've got chicken, frozen chicken, and this is about to turn something. And do you know what? We are one of them families that will get all this food, buy loads of fresh food, and then half it goes off because we either go out and eat one night or something's going on. So we don't end up using it. And then it just gets like that. I mean, a couple of weeks ago, I don't know if anyone else had this issue, but a couple of weeks ago, I... We, my whole family got ill, so I did a food shop, and then the next day we were all really ill, and then it was like, oh, no one's really going to eat this food now, so then I wasted a lot. So when I can possible, and if it's obviously the same nice and everything else, I always get frozen stuff so that we've always got food in, and so we'll just take them chicken out as we as and when, and that will go for a lot of our meals. Because um, here I've got the heater kit, and that'll be one of our meals this week with this chicken so do you see what I mean so that yeah and then if in case we didn't one week that same week to have decide to have that chicken we'll have it in the freezer so it's not going to go off so then it can do with other meals for when we go shopping again so it just makes a lot more sense you know on the budget side of things um 
this here just pizza that's mainly for our easy nights i mean i might actually do that this week on saturday night and we do like pizza night with the kids um here is just couscous i love couscous and it's just i put this you know i make it it's really easy to make with this make it up and i generally put it with um lunches and stuff for like the day, if I'm on the go, because I'm always on the go, to be honest. So um, just to make sure that I actually eat, I will put up things like that and maybe chuck in something else with it. Um, and that will be what I eat, basically, because I'm one of them that runs around so much that I don't, I, I forget about myself. Um, I don't know if there's a lot of mums out there that do that, but I do. I forget about myself a lot and, and then I don't eat. And then I'm actually quite, you know, I need to keep weight on, so that's what that's for. Um, I'm the only one who eats that, to be honest, in this house. But Jonathan might eat it, but I'm the only one, really. Yep, I like putting salads with things. So when I've got fajitas, when I've got pizza and stuff like that, I love putting a bit of salad. So I'd have that, the um, plum, baby plum tomatoes, um, cucumber, and I also do a little thing where... A bit of salt this is what I personally like I love this little thing so I do this so see cucumber and the uh, little tomatoes I'll cut them up dice them up dice that up and then I'll put it in with vinegar so it's going to sound strange for some people but it's something I really like so you put vinegar in it you put salt in it and squeeze half a lemon in it and my blimming goodness it is the most amazing little thing so I like snacking on stuff like that so I'm a bit strange like that I like stacking on salad you know but yeah this again convenience here's here comes my convenience food this is me again making sure that I eat properly and um, to try and gain some weight because I would like to try and gain weight um and this is just yeah they're 49 ph they just make sense so here again we've got you know like the dunkers um but a lot cheaper so yeah, pack lunches, snacks, you know, that type of thing. Um, this is like, if you look at it, it looks like anchor butter. So yeah, I like that. This here is garlic herbs, soft cheese. Yeah, I would have this on crackers and things like that for snacks. Um, this is really, this is only, uh, it's also 50% less fat. Look, ooh, that looks good. Um, and it's 49p. So yeah, 49p. So I think that's a bargain because that's like Philadelphia, if you like. Uh, this here, we have got ham. This is for the kids mainly because basically Isabella, my daughter, has sandwiches for school and things like that. She doesn't eat any other ham, just that ham. So that's what that's for. Going along the same lines with sandwiches, we all like egg mayonnaise in this house and my daughter especially. So that's what she can get in some of her sandwiches at school. Um, this is just wrapping foil for sandwiches. <laughs> um, this here, we've got pizzas, little mini pizzas. Uh, always good to have, about 49p each, I think. And they're just really good to have because um, my kids love pizza. So good for snack times, lunch times, things like that. Uh, we've done that. Savory rice, yep, yeah, we like that. And we've got butter chicken cooking sauce and this this looks very interesting i can't show you Let's see if i can show you it's got like a little um little powder in there for a bit more flavor i think and this was about 89p i think it was on special oh my goodness i'm so excited to try that because we love curry in this house so again we'll use that with this chicken and we already have rice so we didn't need rice this week um this here bolognese so that will go with the mints um and obviously and going back round here spaghetti just get the cheaper one because i'm telling you now which i think these are about something stupid like 20p they taste the same it's pasta it's spaghetti pasta and it tastes the same please excuse my nails milk we go through so much milk in this house thanks to harrison here we've got the Mediterranean style rice, two bags of those. Generally, me and Jonathan are the ones that have that, and we will then complement that with so I'll do chicken and, and just one of these bags of rice. It's such an easy little meal, quick meal to do. Um, and if we want to sit down and have a, a different meal to the kids, that's what we do. Cod, can't go wrong. 
can't go wrong with some cod fillets frozen again so there's four in there and that will do a few meals again that will go really nice bit of cod with this bag of rice or that rice or couscous lovely be absolutely nice that would that sort of thing we'd eat and again they're frozen so they won't go off now now we've got pasta always have pasta in this house it's a must. It's one of our quick meals for the week if it's a busy night, like if we have a school uh, after school club, things like that. So that's what we do. That's the stirring sauce that we tend to use for it. If we're doing a quick one, or we use like a pasta bake sauce with cheese, we like that in this house. Red onions, need I explain? <laughs> Red onions, they go complement all of the salad, all of the things really that we have going on. Then mushrooms got to have mushrooms, got to have mushrooms, love mushrooms, again no particular reason, they can go with other meals, and um, then we've got here, we've got the complete cat food, right, so this here, which he has wet food as well, but this here, and he likes this, and this is just like that go cat, I think it's called, just like that, and this I think was something like 89 or 99p, I mean I really can't be sure, but it's very cheap compared to the big, to, compared to the brand, that's the exact same, by the way. Can I just tell you, my cat absolutely loves it. So I recommend save your money there. Here we've just got, we've just got here wipes. These were £1.79, I believe. So pack, four packs of wipes. What, what more could you ask for? I mean, they're just wipes. They do the same thing. Oh, and these here are really good. Um, these here are really good so we've got the floor wipes and these again just explain themselves then we've got washing powder this here was 2 99 and can I tell you 40 washes and can I tell you it smells absolutely amazing and it washes your clothes just the same as any other brand so please save your money there because I'm telling you it's really really good so coming back over here let me just make sure I haven't missed anything oh I did I think sausage rolls snacks my children love them i love them too if i want some savory i uh, just want to make sure i haven't missed anything so i'm not sure crisps sorry about the noise crisps 30 packs for like two pounds something it was it's amazing value we love crisps in this house we are crisp lovers then we have got this right i'm gonna leave i've left my favorite till last because this was a purchase that was nothing to do with what I needed in my shopping but I'm just going to basically show you now so it's these here you can see those and yes I've got number four and number three so anyone with OCD please look away now <laughs> because I liked this smell I think it was this one I liked or this one but they didn't have the other one left because people were buying these like really quick so it's just here I'll show you so it's just luxury hand and body wash. Apparently body wash as well. Ooh, like that. It's really, really nice. Smells lovely. So it's just that little luxury touch in the bathroom. And this here is luxury hand and body lotion. So I just got these basically for my bathroom. Just to look really pretty on the side. And that's the ha hand cream. And they're really, they smell very nice. They were a little bit expensive for hand wash and, and Ha like what I would normally pay for you know just hand wash and things like that but this is a look I'm going for if you like so they were £2.49 each but I mean you know what they're a dupe for don't you so it, it, it looks pretty good so it's much cheaper than what the actual ones with these have cost would have cost and they just look I think they just look really really nice in my bathroom just that little posh nice look or oh, I like that sort of look anyway it's very clean looking very um smart I'm... hi everyone sorry about that my battery just died so in between charging my camera my battery and my camera um i put my shopping away however i did have a few things that i wasn't quite finished with showing you so i'm going to quickly show you them now so the other things that i didn't show you um before my battery died was these these wraps so these wraps that I would use for a nicer way to have a sandwich, basically. My daughter really likes these as an alternative to a normal sandwich sometimes. So we would generally have that. Also, I'm very interested in making with these pizza wraps. They're actually a thing. 
And yes, as you've gathered, we do like pizza in this house. So the other thing was these little miniature potatoes. Little miniature potatoes. They're just a really good side for any meals that we have that we haven't got, well, that we haven't got a side for, if you like. So good with chicken, good with most things. Obviously not with pasta and not with anything like that, but it's good for just general sides throughout the week. Peanut butter. This here is mainly for my partner. He has this on crackers. Again, I say he is a gym freak and he likes to be healthy. Peanut butter is a must in this house and it has to be crunchy. The next thing, I'm not sure if I showed you this either, just pesto. And this here I would use just to basically put in pasta. And I love pesto pasta. I absolutely love it. It's just a quick, easy meal. I'll also use this for a side. So I do put it in the pasta and then I'd use that as a little side dish as well. Um, yeah, I love pesto. And that's a really good price as well. Avocados. So again, this mainly is for my partner. He likes avocados. I like them too, but he mainly eats these ones. And then the last but not least, we have bread. Now this here was only 50p and it tastes the same as bread. Believe it or not, it actually tastes like bread. <laughs> we have a lot of toast in this house. My kids absolutely are loving Nutella on toast every morning this week so far. So we'll see how long that continues for. <laughs> So that will go and conclude today's video guys. So if you did enjoy this video, please could you give it a big thumbs up and make my day. Also, if you would like to stick around, please subscribe. We're always happy to have new subscribers. And yeah, I'll see you on my next one. Bye.